Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Josh and you're watching our history. Today we're going over the life of Rahul Ki the Beard, famously known for sacrificing herself to save her brother. So if you enjoy this, please be sure to like and if you're new here, consider smashing the subscribe button. If this isn't your first rodeo and you haven't shown some love to the subscribe, now is your opportunity. Thank you very much for watching. Rahul de Beer, affectionately referred to as a Rahul Ki, etches her name indelibly in the annals of history as an Afrikaner heroine. Born in 1831 and departing from this world in 1843, her life was brief yet profound profoundly impactful. She emblazoned her story into the collective consciousness through an act of unparalleled selflessness, a sacrifice that resonates through time. The roots of Rachel's bravery can be traced to a family lineage descending from George Stephanus de Beer, a man of note born in 1794. Rachel's familial heritage intertwined with her innate courage, culminating in a defining moment that would reverberate through generations. In the face of adversity, Rachel demonstrated unwavering valor by offering her own life as a shield to safeguard that of her younger brother, Dirki de Beer. This sacrificial act, embodying the very essence of sibling devotion, stands as a luminous exemplar of love and valor. Rachel's name shines as a beacon in the rich tapestry of South African history. Her narrative transcends the confines of time, encapsulating the essence of heroism that flourishes in even the darkest hours. Through her selflessness, Rachel casts a resolute reminder that bravery knows no bounds. It is a virtue that shines brightly, even amid the harshest tribulations. Her story crystallizes the profound truth that the human spirit, fortified by love and compassion, can surmount the most daunting of challenges. The legacy of Rachel de Beer echoes through the corridors of time, kindling flames of inspiration in hearts across the globe. Her saga stirs souls to delve into the depths of their own courage, beckoning individuals to rise above their circumstances and exhibit the same unyielding determination that she displayed. Rachel Key's tale is an eternal flame, a testament to the potency of sacrifice and the enduring power of familial bonds. As we remember by Rachel de Beer. We are reminded that heroes are not confined to the pages of history. They are sculpted through resolute choices and unwavering devotion. The story. In the winter months of 1843, Rachel was a participant in the great trek from the Orange Free State to the southeastern Transvaal. During one of their regular nightly stopovers, the group discovered that a calf named Fricky was missing. Fricky held a special place in the hearts of their children, making his absence a matter of concern. In a search party that was formed to find Fricky, Rachel and her 6-year-old brother inadvertently got separated from the group during dusk. Unfortunately, they became lost in the unknown location. As the night progressed, the weather conditions deteriorated and the temperature dropping significantly with snowfall starting. In a dire situation, where the chances of survival appeared grim. Rachel made a desperate decision to protect her younger brother from the cold. She discovered an anthill that had been hollowed out by an aardvark and quickly removed her own clothes, placing them on her brother. Rachel then commanded him to seek shelter inside the hollowed out anthill. She bravely positioned herself in front of the anthill's opening, intending to shield her brother from the cold. Tragically, Rachel did not survive the night, but her courageous act succeeded in saving her brother's life. The next morning, the trekking party discovered the children, with the brother being the sole survivor of the ordeal. Story in Modern Culture Rachel de Beer is a prominent figure within the Afrikaner culture. This is evident through the numerous streets and schools that bear her name showcasing the deep admiration and respect she commands within the community. Additionally, her influence extends to artistic expressions as seen in the theatrical performance from 2019 that was inspired by her life and achievements. These tributes serve as a testament to her significant impact in the Africana heritage and her lasting legacy historical debate. In October 2012, two Afrikaans journalists brought attention to the similarities between the story of Rachel Ki de Beer and the American heroine Hazel Miner. Their findings were published in the tabloid Bay, a weekly supplement of the Afrikaans newspapers Die Burger, Bild and Volksblatt. The story of Rachel first appeared to imprint around one to three months after the North Dakota's Children's Homes Finder had given wider publicity to the true story of Hazel Miner. The journalists also posted a detailed paper on their findings titled Die Laaste Rits Beweise Rachel Ki is Bluet and Afspeling van Hazel Miner The Last Series of Evidence right. 
Little Rachel is merely a mirror image of Hazel Minor. If you enjoy this channel and you would like to support more content like this, because all contributions are greatly appreciated, please check out the Patreon link in the description below.